What's up, gals and pals? Welcome back to The Last of Us Part 2. So last time we stopped uh, in a horrible place, uh, right in the sewers, which is about the last place I would want to be in a fucking zombie apocalypse. So uh, today promises to be very fun. Especially since like I wasted a lot of fucking ammo last time. I think I only have like a sh some shotgun shells. I don't think I have a lot of bullets left. Also, we can reach the hospital to then torture and question and probably kill someone. Oh god. Oh shit. Off to a good start. Yeah, I have like two bullets. Seven. I do have nine from this one. Fuck Seattle. Uh, I'm gonna fucking hate this today. <laughs> this is not gonna be a fun episode. You motherfucker. For a second I was like, oh I'm fine. Then I was like, hmm, is this a human shape I see there? Fucker. Oh, today's gonna suck. And don't jump me while I'm making shit, I swear to god. Good thing I had my fucking shotgun on. I was expecting something. They kind of look like you can interact with them, but I guess not. I'm just always gonna be fucking guns out, ready to shoot. Is there zombies in the water? They wouldn't do that, right? This is so bad. <laughs> I'm just... I don't want to be here. Ugh. Like anything that's in here is gonna have been here for a long ass time, I have to guess. So it's gonna be like stalkers, clickers, and uh, loaders, shamblers. Oh man, I could almost climb out from here. You know what? Usually I explore like every little nook and cranny. But here, I'm not sure I want to do that. I just kind of want to get the fuck get the out, out of here. as soon as possible. Are we going to be out already? Really? That's it? Alright. Man, I expected to be in these sewers a long ass time. I thought it was gonna be like a whole fucking section. Well, that's not creepy at all. I'm gonna save that. <laughs> I wanna save now that I'm out of these fucking sewers. Uh, if I can be close to the hospital, that would be great. the park uh, that's not much better <laughs> first of all I miss having a little bit of light why did she have to go like why did she have to go now couldn't she rest a little bit and then leave with Jesse like I hate how dark it is and I hate that I'm alone again it's very fucking stressful there's gonna be stalkers I feel like I'm in fucking Jurassic Park like they're hunted by raptors. Fuck it, let's just fucking go, you know? Let's just go. And if something pops up, I'm gonna... You know, I was... That was a joke about the raptors. <laughs> I don't wanna face actual raptors. Is there a fucking predator in here? Or is it like the scars giving each other signals? I'm not usually this stressed out, but today, like, because I knew what I was jumping in, I'm really stressed. Because it's just like, look at this, there's no rows, there's no nothing, it's just fucking chaos. What the f Okay, I kind of expected that. I feel like that would have done a lot more damage. Shit. 
Oh, this is fuck. bad. Oh, fuck. Yeah, what's that? Ask for it, bitch. Oh, I have to remove the fucking arrows every time. Bad choice. Bad move. Bad move. Should have stayed up there. Can I uh, take your arrows? Because I know you had some. Okay, so I'm definitely in fucking scar territory now, right? Who? Oh, I should have noticed. Like, I can barely see him. Okay. What do you mean? Okay, it's not okay. I know he's there. Yeah, keep whistling, asshole. Keep fucking whistling, see where that gets you. Fuck. Fuck. Can I shoot him before he shoots me? So tense. <laughs> Anyone else? Anyone else want a taste of Jesus. my? These must be the scars. Uh, yeah. Doesn't matter. Hospital. And <laughs> she is very focused. Up. Oh, you want to do it yourself, don't you? Man, I am out of fucking everything. What are these like fires? Ooh. One bullet? What am I supposed to do with that? A shitty axe that's already like all spent. I guess it's a straight shot. It kind of looks really open, but it's probably just... This is the only place you can go. Man, if I had a silencer on my fucking uh, sniper... Now that would be awesome. So left or right? I'm guessing if this is scar territory, that means there's no infected, right? Because I assume they would have cleared them out. Okay, here's the road to the hospital. Yeah, so left. Now we're gonna get into some tribal or cult shit. Because, you know, it's not like things weren't bad enough already. Every time I hear flies, it sounds like someone moaning. Now maybe not the best time for art. Because now I'm always worried they're gonna pop something at me. Like I'm always worried of traps. And they can only do it one of each type. Like they've trapped me on the workbench once, so now I'm always gonna expect it. Like they could trap me on looking at my journal, like they put something for you to like draw in your journal, then you look at your journal and that's the trigger for like some trap or something. I don't trust you motherfuckers. I think this is it. Watch for big red signs, scars, fuck these people, stay focused on why you're here. I mean... Survival also? Right? I, go now? I hope that Ellie is like... Wait, is the machete stronger than the axe? I mean, obviously you're risking your life going on a quest like she is, but I hope that in her mind she wants to survive. That she's not just like, oh, I'm... I just hope it's not a suicide mission, you know? Alright, let's fucking go! Alright. I'm being extra careful now. There's a snack in there, but I don't want to risk it. I don't want to risk making noise. In here. 
You know, I need my flashlight to see, but I also hate the way it creates shadows. It's like a really creepy. Doppelganger. Creepy. Very creepy. If I run into that, I'm gonna scream. Oh, there are the snacks. There you go, I didn't need to break that window after all. Whoa, 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 whoa. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. I didn't even see that. Hospital, okay. What about up there? <laughs> There's gonna be someone in there. No. I have to break through the window. There's gonna be someone in that room. Or this guy will spring to life. I see you, motherfucker. Let's fucking go. Okay, now I think he's been dead for a little while. I don't trust it though, I'm always on my toes. And it must be so stressful for Ellie, because I only have to feel like this a couple hours a week. And she has to feel like that all the time. Like, never relaxing. I guess when you're in Jackson, you can kind of relax. You're not gonna spring something at me if I look at this letter, do you? Anyone find this note? My wife Paige is waiting for me back in the old conference. Read this. Put her at Pike and Convention right across from the brew pub. Please take her this medicine. She's pregnant and could die without it. Oh, that sucks. I thought I could make it, but I've lost too much blood. I was sprinting through the woods, heard some whistles. Then an arrow pierced my side. I ducked into this place. I think I'm safe. Can't get any worse, right? I went peacefully. Okay. I hope they live happy lives to our lover. If it's a boy, don't name the kid after me. Go with the name we picked. Okay. Sorry, dude. Looks like he's been dead for a pretty long time. Do you think the wife is still alive? What awaits us on this road? Nothing good. There's nothing like that first playthrough. But if I play it again in the future, it's gonna be a little easier because I'm once you know the layout, it's really not as bad. But when you're like right now, I don't know anything, you know, I, I'm just completely blind. So, like, when you just don't know at all what's coming, you're always on your toes because, like, what's in this room? What's in this room? You just don't know. Like, it could be full of zombies. Like, you have to be on your toes all the time, which it's fun, of course, but it's stressful. I think I can fit. Hmm. Yeah, I'm sure there's absolutely nothing bad on the other side. Oh my god, here we fucking go. Oh, this is what I saw in the trailer. Oh, don't come this way. Don't come this way. Did you hear what Lily did? She did. What? How did this? How did they see me? Off to a bad start already. Okay, here's the question. Can you save this guy? I wonder. I should have saved right before, but like... It probably saved right after he died, right? Yeah, he's already dead. Damn it! Oh, I wanted to know if you could save him. Because like, if you kill them all before he's dead... Shit. 
Now I'll never know. Oh, okay, there's people behind me too. Shit. Let's try and go with the bow for this. And hopefully get the arrows back. And they are all over this place. Man, if only I had a silencer on that sniper, that'd be so good. Yeah, thanks for carrying a big old torch, idiot. This is gonna need some uh, high-level stealth, bitch. Don't, don't see me. Don't see me. See if they were smart, they would travel in packs of. Why'd you whistle? Do you know I'm here? Grab you. Grab you. Motherfucker! How did they. How did she know I was here? She just whistled like right away. Oh, okay. What's the checkpoint? Was it after I killed the one guy? Maybe? Like so... Oh, what the fuck? What the fuck was that? That's some bullshit. My arrow, like... Didn't even go through some branches? Come on. Carolyn, we're under attack. What? Make Who? Who fucking saw that? Who saw that? There was like. Ah oh, shit! Now they're all over the place. Okay, well apparently I can't kill this bitch because uh, someone's got an eye on her. I guess I'll circle back around. Yeah, just split up. Split up for me. Ooh, I almost went for him, <laughs> it would have been too soon. Getcha. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Shut it. Okay, where's Torch Guy? Oh, that's why the whistle, it's to know if their guys are still there. Once he knows they're not, then they call for reinforcements. I can get him first, though. Okay, one there, one there, and then a third one. So they're communic. They probably have some kind of code. It's like, oh, this sound is for this, and this sounds for this. Good night. I think I'm just missing one. There's one over there. I wish I could have saved this guy. When I replay the game, I'm gonna have to see if it's possible. Cause like let's say you kill like you shoot them, you alert them, would they just kill him first and then like come after you? Or would you have a chance to talk to them maybe? Oh man, now I really wanna know. Who are you gonna whistle to now? Huh?
Oh, I missed my shot. Oh shit, there's more. Fuck, there's a bunch more. There's a bunch more! Here I thought I was done. Shit, shit, I gotta go back where there's cover. You don't see nothing. Or do you? gonna be like what's happening there's a lot fewer of us than there was earlier <laughs> he's like hello hello oh they went inside this building at least there's no dogs this time probably should have dogs <laughs> Yeah, yeah, whistle, whistle, whistle. I don't even know where I'm going, but... He's like, is anyone there? <laughs> is everyone dead? At this point, you can use words, dude. Just be like, hello? Is anybody still alive? Because if they get too close to you, they still notice you even when you're, like, crawling on the ground. Whistle all you want. Wrong side. See, that's what you get for being fucking cultists. Don't you think the world's bad enough? Because, like, the wolves are bad, but they don't string up people and then open their fucking innards. So, you know. Remember when I said there was gonna be like a larger enemy? It's like the enemy of my enemy is my friend. It's still pretty much looking like that's what we're getting. <laughs> it's gonna be Ellie and Abby versus these fucking saviors. Oh, sorry, the scars. Oh, okay, he's right there. There's two, there's one in the building. Well, if you come out of the building, I've got a surprise for you. They are very, uh... They love to whistle. They just love to whistle. You know what I love the most? Fuck. Shit, I didn't have my silencer. Okay, I kind of flubbed it at the end there. <laughs> oh, and I use all my weapons, god damn it. Um, shit. Man, that was almost a perfect stealth fucking... Can I restart that? That was almost a perfect stealth. It's because I had the wrong gun equipped. If I had my silencer, maybe I could have killed him. Oh, I can go up there. Oh. Oh, and he's literally right there. Ooh, that was very close. I was going for a melee, honestly, because I thought I missed it. Where's your little friend down there? Oh, there's one up there. Shit. Fucking this guy's there. Uh. 
fucker. That was close. I got careless. I didn't think he would come through the window. And I didn't think there were more. How many are there? Too late. You're too late. You're too late. You better not be on me because she didn't have time to call, so. Just go back in the fucking bushes. Yeah, this is exactly right here. This is exactly the spot you see in the trailer. I think. Uh, are we done? Is that all of them? I don't see anyone else for now, but that doesn't mean there isn't, so let's stay careful. Who? Who? Who the fuck saw me? Oh, I see someone there. Man, this listening mode is not very <laughs> reliable. There's way more people than it shows you. I don't know if this grass is tall enough to hide me. I feel like I'm gonna miss a lot of... If there's shit to find in this area, I'm gonna miss a lot because... They're all over this place. I I'm having a hard time, like, figuring out the layout of, of this place. No, I hear two. What's... What sounds? I didn't make any sound. Fuck you. And right there. Shit. Oh god, three? Fuck, they're all over the place. What's oh god, four? You know, I hate doing this, but I'm feeling kind of Molotov y right now. Ooh, that was close. Are you the only survivor? And that mine got two of them? I got lucky with that one. Are we done here? I think that's it. Ooh. Oh, damn the city. I'm gonna trust you on that, Ellie, even though you would have no way of knowing realistically. I'm gonna trust that that was the last of them. Ooh. And I could get my arrow back. Today was a good day, except for this guy and all these people. But you know, maybe you shouldn't uh, string people up and then open them up. That's just me, to each their own. So I'm guessing there's not really much to find around here, because it's kind of like, it's a battle arena, basically. So probably like little bullets there and there, but mostly just nothing let's head to that hospital oh, yes please am i supposed to like jump there yeah. Ooh. okay let's not get too cocky and that mine work fucking wanders i'm just going <laughs> I'm just walking around with my shotgun out now. I'm just always like, anyone want some of this? Because it's like the perfect react weapon. Because it's like you turn the corner, something jumps at you, you just like, <laughs> just explode them. 
Now I'm feeling like I'm bold and I'm just walking around when I should be hiding. I guess I have to go through here. Now, if I had to guess, and again, I don't know what's going to happen, I would guess that the woman we're looking for is either under siege, maybe we're going to find her like almost dead, she's like wounded, hit, hiding in a corner, hiding from them, or maybe she's already dead, but are we in the hospital? Because I'm just seeing like a bunch of, it's like a makeup store, isn't it? I'm gonna have to try those explosive arrows too. Can I make some? Ooh, I can! It only makes one though, right? Yeah. Yeah, I mean, I say I'm guessing, but and then I name the only options. <laughs> like either she's dead or. Hello! Okay, you could have just killed me there, but thank you for giving me some space so I can shotgun you. Oh shit. I was gonna say, did you come alone? Ow! What the fuck was that? You don't see me, do you? I know you're out there. You're right. Wolf! Not a wolf. Not a girl. Christ. <sighs> right. I can't believe you survived two hos two fucking shotgun shots. What the fuck? Was he wearing body armor? I was like, that first shot's definitely gonna kill him, and then it didn't. Alright, it could have gone. Oh, I didn't really take any damage. So I was gonna say it could have gone better, but. I was so stupid. He was like holding me, and he could have like. just split my head open with his axe. And instead, he was like, nah. I wanna give you some space. Like, okay, well, thanks. Idiot. Dumbass. See, now I'm stocking back up on shit and I'm starting to like have a lot again. Except bullets. Which... So the wolves think I'm a scar and the scars think I'm a wolf. Always with the labels. Another one wants to uh, fuck with me here. I wonder if there are branching paths in this game because remember this one, like the building where I was I was seeing like this huge way in front of me and then I could go in the building with the stalkers. I could have totally dropped there and like I didn't see any ways back inside the building. So either that's like a totally optional area but then it's impossible because then how would she fall in the river and end up all the way here? Which how lucky was she that like the fucking sewers she fell in <laughs> led all the way to the fucking <laughs> to the hospital? That was some luck. You know, for all the shit that happens to her, she is very lucky. Should I be a little worried that they're restocking me with all this shit, or is it just because they know you just went through a lot of things, so they want to give you some again? Because they're giving me a lot of stuff right now, and I don't know how I feel about that. <laughs> oh yeah, I should do that. Yeah! I have a super axe. Oh, that doesn't look like a battle area at all. Okay, so yeah, we're not in the hospital yet. Are you gonna throw a boss at me right now? Like some heavy armored guy, or like shamblers, or... You're not giving me all this cover for no reason. Or do you want me to think that? Like they want you to think it's gonna be a bus area and then there's nothing? Just to make you nervous? These fuckers. 
way out in the open here, which I don't like. I'm sure nothing bad's gonna happen to me when I reach the bottom. No? Oh. This is all too, a little too easy. It's all a little too quiet. They're making me nervous on purpose, right? Like, showing you this big boss area, and then having nothing there. Oh, I don't like this. Batmandar? Oh, she's pretty cool. Don't like that. These are all battle areas. Why are they empty? Like, what's on the other side of this fucking wall? My fucking shotguns, I don't try nothing. Come on, come on, come on, come on. A whole workbench is there. You think I'm gonna trust that? And a safe? I didn't see nothing but no safe. And Jor, I don't really care about that because if I die, I die. Like, I'm just gonna restart. Care about that right there. I'm gonna try it, but I'm fucking ready. Okay. What about that save, though? Nora? Did Nora escape? Wait, no. These are wolves, right? Because Isaac's with the wolves, so they're talking about like a cultist? A uh, scar? You call him a cultist. This doesn't seem like a good idea, but okay. Is there a guy just sitting there? I'm uh, making a lot of sense. Is that Nora? <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. Are, we, are you really sitting with your back to water with headphones in your ears? Okay. Okay. Someone here is not uh, very smart. Hope you're enjoying that music, girl. Don't make a fucking sound. Man, what a Handle. fucking idiot! Really, Easy. playing a fucking PSP. You know a girl named Nora? Sure, yeah. Where is she? In the hospital. Where in the hospital? Yeah, they're they're clearing out the upper floors. She's somewhere in there. Yeah. Should not try nothing. I mean, Ellie would still have killed her anyways, but... What the fuck were you playing? Are you stupid? You're just gonna be playing games? What world do you think you live in? And giving me a lot of shit. It's all worrying. <laughs> Means I'm gonna need to use a lot of firepower to get out of here, probably. We still haven't found Tommy either. I wonder where he is. You're dead. She certainly is. Okay, so we know she's in the hospital, just not aware. Word is we're almost wrapped up. Good. I got my girl waiting for me at the top. You shit me. They put you in jail again. Hey, we get the job done. I bet you do. Well, this is not fair. I'm telling you, man. Data soldier. It makes these shifts so much easier. <laughs> sure. I'll keep that in mind. Oh, oh, they're all over the place. Sounds like scars are getting closer. That's our guys executing those freaks. Hey, 
you hear why we're all getting called up to the fob? I heard that Isaac wants us to retake all of downtown. I heard we might take the fight to them. <laughs> no way. Not after what went down last time. Even Isaac isn't that crazy. What I heard. What happened exactly? Okay, one there, one up there, one patrolling there, one in the tent there, and one unaccounted for who was just having this conversation. And if I could stealth all of them without alerting anyone, that would be awesome. Maybe with arrows I could? Shit, this time. I was hoping they wouldn't fucking see him die. Oh, whoops, hello. Right here. Shit. Oh, God damn it. No, 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 no. I didn't think they would see him die. I guess I'll start from the other side. I'm gonna start with the guy in the. Are you just taking a piss, dude? What are you doing? You know, it'd be nice if you could carry the bodies and, like, hide them. Ah, oh, shit. There's a dog. Oh, there's... People there. Oh, that, that could... That might be a good thing if I can... Might not even have to kill them. Ooh, there's a lot of people in here. I guess this is one of their bases. One of their home bays. Right grab her, grab her! Oh my god! Okay. Shit. Like, I didn't get the prompt soon enough. Fuck. I'm not playing very well right now. If I could cause like a commotion outside, maybe they'd all leave. Like if I threw a bomb or something. Okay, this time fucking grab her right away. Tense, but I like it because you know at least here the layout's clear like I know where I'm going it's more like a stealth game shit Shut it. Eat shit. Ooh, good thing the dog didn't smell the fucking dead person right next to them Somehow, I'm pretty sure they would have smelled it, but okay. Thank you. Oh shit, it's the dog. It's gonna smell me. No? Okay. I'm trying a new technique called Don't Kill Everyone. Might bite me in the ass, but... Fuck! There's someone there!
Ooh, this is nerve-wracking. I don't even know where I'm going. I might end up... Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh! oh. You bitch, you're getting shot again for this. Don't, don't. Ooh, that was a good shot. Headshot. Ooh, another good shot. Double kill. Heads up. Oh, fuck. Oh, that's not fair. It's a heal here. Okay, maybe they didn't see me coming this way. Like a fuck. Why didn't I get the prompt to fucking grab him? I'm gonna end up having killed all of them anyways, god damn it. I wanted to go stealthy! I restart the encounter, that's like all of them. Shit. Fuck it. All because this one asshole saw me, damn it. Too far away, I don't wanna risk it. I want to like alert all of them. Oh man, if I if I cut through here instead of going left, you know, it's easy to say that after the fact. Damn it. Like it went so. It was going so well until then. They come over here. It's all your fault. Yeah. Your friends died because you had to fucking spot me. <laughs> kind of victim blaming. <laughs> See, it was going really well before that. Where am I going though? There's an exit there. Because of the light, I feel like that's where I'm supposed to go here. Yeah. Like, one of these could have been Nora, and I wouldn't even know. I guess Ellie does know what she looks like. And I could have been... I could have just cut through there. I'm telling you, I'm gonna do a pacifist run of the game, <laughs> eventually, because when once you know where the exit is, yeah, you can just go right there. How convenient that the one person I'm looking for is holed up. Far away from everyone else. Alright, just a bunch of supplies. I don't think there's anything important for me in there. And I'm worried someone's gonna jump me seeing as I'm in enemy territory. Is there another fucking idiot listening to music instead of Is that you, Nora? I'm surprised these people can still listen like how would you get a fucking PS Vita to work? It's fucking gaslighting from Sony because you know damn well the the fucking PSP like the battery after a few years going unused it would like inflate eventually like you couldn't use it anymore that's what happened to mine and happened to a bunch of people too so yeah to to pretend that a Vita would survive the fucking apocalypse oh I see I see that's some bullshit is that Nora Abby would still be in her cell. When the fuck was Abby here? I'm not stupid. You're gonna tell us where she went. When Isaac talks to us about this, I'm gonna say what I think happened. 
Knock yourself out. I've got work to do. So Abby escaped? Nora. I'm not going down for her, man. Don't worry. And they would hear the shit out of me climbing up here with my backpack and like all of this shit on me. There is no way. I'm gonna fall. She's gonna fall through. No? They would fucking hear me for sure. How subtle, Ellie. Can't believe that worked. <laughs> okay, so Abby escaped. Wonder why. Maybe she's off on another revenge tour. Gone to kill the scars, maybe? Don't scream. She would have screamed. Put that shit down. You remember me? Remember me? Yeah. You remember me. What do you want? Abby was here earlier. Where'd she go? Apparently they don't know. I don't know. You shoot me. The sound will have every soldier come running. You'll still be dead. Except all the ones that are dead already. Tell me where she went and I'll think about letting you go. We could have killed you. Maybe you should have. Uh, yeah, you definitely should Maybe have. you should have stayed the fuck out of Jackson. And that too. Where's Abby? You still hear his screams? Excuse me? What? Are you f are you fucking with me right now while I have my gun on you? I hear them every night. Yeah. Yeah, that little bitch got what he deserved. Oh, okay. You fucking <laughs> Help! Trespasser! Somebody, please! Uh Okay. What? Oh, I failed? I had to kill her? Okay, you didn't tell me that. Somebody, please! Over here! Fuck. Nora! You can't escape this! Ellie's on a fucking rampage! I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Is there any way to kill her before that? I guess I could have shot Got her. But... Ah! Keep up with Nora. Yeah, no kidding. Got you. Yo! Yeah! Ow. I mean. Can't blame her for fighting for her life. Ooh, nice uh, right hand there, but you're still gonna die. I'm the protagonist, and you're not. What, what would have happened if I just shot her in the first like area? Throw down your weapon. Nah, I don't think I will. Oh, you're stuck now. Back up! Put your gun down. You can walk away from this, okay? I can Shut the fuck up! Gun down! Hands up! Get back! You should have your gun on her, not on them. Nowhere to go. Oh, so yeah, the spores is like instant, unless you're in Take her out! 
Come on, give me, give me access to my shit. I can get them right now. Oh shit! Oh, there's infected. Of course. I still need to kill her though. Fuck! I thought maybe. Maybe. <laughs> okay, so we have a lot of clickers, three guys. I guess I can just let the clickers take care of them and use that time to. You guys should worry about your own fucking lives. Made it. Okay, so I guess there was no way to kill her until then. But like, what if I got a good shot? Like, I wasn't able to, but I could have. I mean, she, we already know she's gonna die. She's infected now, so you could just let her turn. I am so sorry about what's happening there. That thing looked like it was gonna get up. That's not gonna block much. In this slow walk of doom. <coughs> Damn, she's starting to be all like veiny already. It's that fast. Where's Abby? It's too late, she has no reason to talk to you now. Yeah, breathing spores. I'm magic. You're her. Hey, Firefly. There are no fireflies anymore. I guess Ellie wouldn't know. Like, in her mind, there still are, because Joel never told her the truth. I'm fucking dead anyway. Why would I tell you anything? <coughs> because I can make it quick. Or I can make it so much worse. It's a good point. Think about what he did. How many people are dead because of him? Well, you'll have to Jeez. explain to her because I don't think she knows. I'm not giving up, my friend. That's honorable. Come on, Ellie. Come on. You don't. You don't have to. Like, you can just just leave this controller here. Just, you know. I'm not gonna have the option, am I? It has to happen. You and I, we're in this together, so. Well, now, now the more I wait, the worse it is. You're bringing me all the way back to the theater after this? Cause uh... Damn, that's a long ass way! How the fuck did I come back?
Like, how did I escape that place? Damn. It's me. Are they even still here? Are you okay? Christ. Is that your blood? I mean, I'm alive, so that's all you need to know. She's hiding out in the... in this aquarium. You're shaking. Okay. Damn, you've been shaking the whole way back? Because that's a long way away. Let's get you cleaned up. Or maybe she's shaking because, like, now I have to face my friends after what I did, you know? Ooh. You, uh, you feeling all right? Arms up. Ooh. Ooh. Seen better days. You wanna you wanna tell her the truth? Maybe would help you to uh, get things up your chest. You know, tell her what you did. I made her talk. I guess they didn't show that bit where like she eventually talked, but I don't wanna lose you. Good. Oh. Okay, see, I don't know why it never really occurred to me, like after what happens at the end of the first game, for some reason when I think about whether Joel told her the truth, my mind always went to the cure, like oh there actually there was a cure, and like I, I preferred to save your life, but for some reason it's like I almost forgot that he had to kill all, like pretty much all the fireflies. I guess because I assumed like that was only a small, a small group of them. But I guess maybe like that was all of them, maybe almost. So it wasn't until Nora said that just now that it occurred to me that Ellie doesn't know that he basically not only did he stop the cure and saved her life. That's like one thing. It's one thing, but it's like another thing that he also like just killed them all. And that's like. It's like another thing entirely. Because when Abby killed Joel at the beginning, I thought like, I didn't really think it had to do with the cure because I was like, how would they know? Like, if everyone there is dead, how would they know it was him? Nora recognized her because of your immunity, so that means they know about it. Which makes you really, if they knew that was her, like why would they capture her? You know, they just left her there. They didn't kill her. They didn't capture her like maybe if you capture her eventually you can find another doctor or something who then could find a cure and now that makes me wonder like if uh, Ellie does learn about what he did would that change her mind like would that matter to her that he lied to her this whole time and like killed all these people because she's killed a lot of people too so that can't really bother her that much I just I, for some reason I wasn't thinking about that I really thought it was got like uh, Abby's thing was just gonna be like more personal revenge, and maybe it is. I don't know. I guess we'll find out. Oh, I thought we were. I, I thought we were about to play a flashback with Abby where they find out what happened to the fireflies, but fucking Ellie went there herself, so she, she does know. 
I guess maybe she does know what happened and she just doesn't care. Because, you know, clearly it's something that's bothered her and like it took years before she even talked about it to Joel and then he still lied to her. And so I guess she was like, you know what, I'm just going to find out by myself. I'm surprised she would go all the way back there. That, that was far away from, that was really far away from Jackson. The plot thickens. La plot s'épaisse. Two years earlier. I can't pull my weapon out, so I guess there's no enemies in here yet. Left a lot of stuff behind. I don't really know exactly if Joel killed all of them or only like some of them. From what I remember, it was just like a couple soldiers and Come shit. On. There's gotta be something. She's looking like so for some evidence, some some proof of what he did. Like some proof of a uh, maybe her test results. What is she gonna find? Because at this point, leave. at this point, they would just be corpses, just skeletons. It's been like years. It's pretty courageous of her to come all the way here. What is this? Oh. Oh, that's you, girl! The growth has clearly mutated. Let's see if the test results corroborate our theory. This is big. That's you, girl! That proves she was the last person here. By this time tomorrow, we will have altered the course of history. Clearly, it really bothers her that. Like, she can tell that. Fucking Joel is lying to her. And you know when when he was like, is there anything else you want to react? And she goes like, no. And to me it was such an accepting no, like she really seemed at peace. But I guess it's because in her mind she make up her mind that she's like, alright, clearly you're not gonna tell me what I wanna know, so I'm just gonna find out for myself. There was a no of accepting that he's not gonna say the truth. You know, I'm glad. I cataloged and collected all this rare hospital equipment. As soon as I'm done, I hear that there's no use for it anymore. I cannot fucking believe you guys voted to disband. Okay, so they, there was some of them and then they disbanded. I get it. This was a miracle that slipped through our fingers. It's fucking shitty, but the whole world is shitty. How can we give up like this? What now? Settle in QZs? Join some third-rate resistance groups? Fuck that. Someone still has to care. I'll spend the rest of my life trying to find them or die trying. Them, do you mean immune people? Do you mean finding cures? Or do you mean getting vengeance on us? That's probably what it is. But it shouldn't be about vengeance, man. It should just be about, like... There could there could be... It is a miracle what happened to Ellie, but it could have happened to someone else. Even if it's like one in a million, that person could exist, but... They would probably keep it a secret, so it'd be really hard to find them. Oh, I think this is it. This is the room where it happened, right? Uh oh. Most people have left already. I don't know which group I'm gonna join. I was one of the ones that wanted to go after the smuggler and the girl. They said, even if we found her or by some miracle found someone else that's immune, yeah, it made no difference. Because the only person who could develop a vaccine is dead. Or by some miracle found someone else that's immune, it made no difference. Cole found someone else that's immune, it made no difference. Because the only person. Oh, they're about to have quite the conversation. Come here. What the hell are you thinking? Running off in the middle of the night like that. You talk to me. You don't just leave me a goddamn note. You fucking lied to me, dude. You must know by now, why else would she be here? Tell me... What happened here? You can't lie anymore, man. 
If you lie to me one more time, I'm gone. You will never see me again. But if you tell me the truth, I'll go back to Jackson. Mm. No matter what it is. Okay. Just say it. She already knows, so you know. Joel. Making a vaccine would have killed you. So I stopped them. Don't you fucking touch me! I'll go back. But we're done. Close her up. It's gonna leave quite a scar. Oh man. You know, I don't know how I feel about this. <laughs> because when I finished the first game, I remember thinking this is the perfect ending because they're both still alive and you know the player knows what happened and Joel knows but Ellie didn't know and then when she asks him he's like oh nothing happened and uh, they have other people uh, I don't I don't remember what that final line is but like it was so good it was perfect because it left you on like you could it, you couldn't tell if she knew or if she didn't know it was like this perfect in between where like it could be either way and then you leave on that in credits roll and that was like the perfect fucking ending and I never thought there'd be a sequel because it was so self-contained because it ended so perfectly leaving the door wide open and it's like from now anything could happen like she could learn she could know the truth she could not know they could live happy together she could be mad at him like she any scenario could have happened and so I do feel conflicted about them. Like it's very interesting and I'm very involved in this story, but I'm also conflicted because I don't know if I wanted to see all this go down. Like, I don't know if I wanted to see her learn the truth. And part of me still feels like maybe the story would be better if you don't know, like if it's all just left open. Because a lot of stories do that, you know, where they go on too long and like they explain all the mysteries and it's like something that was cool in the first one. It's not as cool now that you've explained it, like like in Star Wars, like in fucking Highlander. Like in, there's so many examples of things where like, oh, it's cool and mysterious and then uh, you explained it too much. Now it's not cool anymore. The question of whether she knew the truth and like whether they would ever have that discussion like it begged an answer because you, of course you can't just and at, for the first like the first part of the game i thought it wasn't going to be addressed like because he's gone now you know joel's dead so i was like oh okay so it, we just never they just never had that discussion i didn't expect flashbacks and all that stuff so i'm glad it's in there because it begged 
the question of like how would they never talk about it you know unless she just believed this lie but uh it it's also like did, did i really want to know <laughs> because now there's no ambiguity you know it's just out in the open she knows she, she learns the truth and that's it so i don't know yeah, i'm conflicted but you know it, there these characters are interesting enough and the story is good enough that i do i am ha happy i am happy to see it play out to see their you know to get to hear their performance and like i'm guessing it's all the same writers and whatever so to see the writers get to continue their the story they started but i can see how it would be very controversial um that they address all of this when i see when, when an ending as good as the first one where you leave like on this ambiguous note usually the only good sequel is like an unrelated story so like i figured if there was ever another last of us it would follow other characters in the same universe they'd be like oh we want to explore the universe but ellie and joe's story this is done you know so but obviously that's not what they went for so uh, i can see how maybe some people were mad or angry or disappointed or i still haven't seen anything in the game that makes me understand why some people like hated this game like they said it was one of the worst games of the year like they were really angry i saw some review some not the reviewers all the reviewers said like oh it's a 10 out of 10 game but i saw a lot of players angry at it so and i still haven't seen anything that makes me understand that feeling so very interesting stuff but uh, we've gone on long enough Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you're enjoying this playthrough. And uh, merci beaucoup d'avoir regardé mon vidéo. My girlfriend said I'm about halfway through the game, which surprised me. I thought it maybe like it'd be like maybe two thirds, but there's still the whole cult thing to explore. We haven't really seen Abby again, um, so yeah, I guess we'll find out more next time. So thank you for watching, and uh, see you in the next one. Bye.